and here we go again guys this is George from Abysmal giving you a review on behalf of and like Christ magazine um, today we're gonna talk about Canadian band B Grimic Simius and they have a new release out through Dark Descent Records this new release is entitled the enslavement conquest um, this uh, release is comprised of nine original compositions and uh, one uh, incantation cover for the title of Impending Diabolical Conquest. Um, upon listening to that one, I think they did a pretty good job, even though you know it's hard to compare that against an original, uh, which sounds differently, but they haven't done it in their own way. I think it's pretty well done. Um, now overall I don't think I'm gonna go over each song because they all have a similar approach to it. I mean that's the way how Big Grand Eximius does her compositions. Uh, to me, basically all that I hear here is sort of like a destroyer 666 uh, worship uh, based upon the Unchained the Walls album. That is just what I see. I hear a lot of Australian style influences here. Um, they're definitely very good at what they do and again this is what they're happy with but again you know when you're a fan of a genre and, and you know you, you cannot help it whether you're a musician or not you know oh hey yeah, yeah I like this riff because or you would say well I like it because they sound like so-and-so or fuck this really sh sucks because I've never heard it done by anyone and that's why they don't do it because it sucks or to do something really good it's like dude we have to copy these guys because they're awesome they're a heavy influence and whatnot well in this case I would say the latter applies probably a little more um, towards the destroy 666 comment that I just made so there you go now um, they are actually much more of a live band uh, and I'm saying that they're much more of a live band because they um, show they have had a lot of shows uh, played live during uh, last year's um, you know time developments let's call it that um, we're supposed to be getting some uh, visits from Big Grammar Simeus in the US although I really don't see a whole lot as of this very second in their website now um, I will tell you this that if you like the Australian based death thrashy thing with a hint of black metal here and there then I do believe that the enslaving conquest is the right thing for you to listen to um, I am not into their kind of music very much but again just like I did with the Minotaur uh, review it's unfair on my behalf to give something to uh, a band that I know is talented but I don't like what they do that's that's basically it I mean they got their thrashy death metal um, thing going on and that is that is uh, the way it should be with them they're happy with their product they move forward again when you have somebody else listening to that it is a whole different story and that is where I'm at uh, myself right now but again if you're into the thrashy death metal part uh, is in the case of the story 666 in the uh, Unchained the Wolves album I think that is a, a highly fair comparison and I've already mentioned it twice actually but I, I feel that strongly about it that I need to to tell you guys to give you a base now if you listen to both these albums and you say you know Holy George you are full of shit you know and stop picking your nose and eating your boogers in the middle of a fucking music review then you might change your mind well I'll tell you what I just ate three boogers and it's not doing anything else for me to I guess we're out of juice okay so give it a chance man just give it a chance go ahead and listen to this make your comparisons make your own decisions again just like I said with the Manator uh, release I did I will withhold uh, from a rating because I don't think it would be fair again um, there's quality there is work there's blood sweat and tears all over this record and I think it's worth listening if you're into that kind of thrashing death metal alright guys so this is what I got this is George from abysmal holy earn holy that's for you to decide alright guys death metal all the way I'm out of here